in the quiet embrace of the night, embark on a journey of self-discovery, where the stars become guides and shadows reveal the poetry of our souls. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create 3D parallax effect in CapCut. I use four different photos, one of the background which is sky, and the middle ground which is mountains, and the foreground which is the man with his camera. Take a picture. Did you know that the voice at the beginning video was made by Dab Dab? In the quiet embrace of the night, embark on a journey of self-discovery. So, this is a great tool to convert text to human-like speech in seconds. Here, you can also create a realistic AI talking avatar using your photo. Also, you can use various templates. Now, let's add your audio. You can use either text-to-speech, or record, or upload your file. So, I select text-to-speech. Here, you can even choose different languages, genders, and more. Hit generate, and now this is your talking avatar. Hi, I'm not a real human, but with this tool you can create realistic talking photo. And there's a lot of AI tools that you can do in DubDub, like AI voiceover, AI writing, and more. Just hit the link below to try it for free. Alright, so first let's create your environment using composite technique. I want to start with the sky as the background element. I'm gonna set the duration to about 6 seconds. And after that, set the aspect ratio as well. So I select 16 by 9 for landscape view. Then I add a mountain. And we are going to make selection on the mountain. By the way, before you import these photos, first you can cut out the subject using editing program by save as PNG file. But I don't wanna spend my time there, so in CapCut, we have automatic tool, so under video, go to remove background, and turn on custom removal. Select the smart brush. Let's point the timeline to the first frame, so we can mask the whole frame until the end. And draw on the mountain. And do the same way to add other subjects. You can also use the eraser tool to deselect the part you don't want to appear. Then you could use the adjustment to make them match better with each other. I'm going to add fog effect to give more contrast between the foreground and the mountain. So, go to mask, and set it to circle. Then bring the feather to create smooth effect on the edge. And apply this behind the foreground. Now, we are going to animate each layer. So I want to start with the mountain or middle ground. The reason why I leave the sky background because the sky is far away from your camera. I mean, your screen. So it doesn't need to be animated. Let's point the timeline to the first frame and click keyframe. Move to the end and click keyframe once again. And scale up just a little bit, maybe to about plus 1% because 
the mountain is a bit far away from your camera so we just need very little movement here and do the same way to other layers for this mountain i'm gonna scale up quite a bit more than previous one so if the subject gets closer to the camera the movement will be even faster Now I want to add particle effect and place this on the foreground. Let's animate the same way. And for this one, I scale up even more as if this is very close to the camera. The reason why I add this element because this really helps to add 3D feels, especially on the foreground. To make it better, let's add chrome blur effect. and I hide the chromatic color by set it to 50 and the blur to about 10 just to make the whole environment feels more connected as the final touch I want to add some minor adjustment to make it even better And here's the result. So that's how to create 3D parallax effect in CapCut. You can also do the same technique on CapCut Mobile. So thank you so much for watching. If you did like this video, please give me a thumbs up. I will see you later in the next video.